What's up, everybody? Welcome to Jump Wave. Today, we're going to be recreating the organ sound from Arctic Monkeys 505 on the Korg Mini Log. The organ sound in this song was inspired by the soundtrack to The Good, The Bad, and The Ugly. It was long thought to be a sample from the movie, and while it does sound remarkably similar, a video by Three Minutes with Mark makes a pretty convincing argument for why it isn't a sample. And I'll link that video in the description for you to hear for yourself. Anyway, let's jump right in. First, let's initialize this patch by going to edit mode and selecting the fifth button from the left, right above where it says chord. We're gonna press that button. Now the screen's gonna tell us initialize program execute, question mark. Now we're gonna turn the program value knob to the right. Now the screen's gonna say initialize program, press right. We're gonna press the, the right button here. And now it says initialized, and that just gives us a basic sawtooth wave to start with. All right, now that we have our basic initialized patch here, now we can begin programming our organ sound. So the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna go over to the keyboard octave and we're going to push it all the way over to the right to the fifth octave. The next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna go to the VCO section here and we are going to go to VCO one and we are going to set it to a triangle wave. And then we are going to bump it up to the fourth octave at the top there. The shape, we're gonna set it at about noon. And um, and the pitch, let's slightly detune it just a little bit at about five cents positive. And we're gonna set the mixer to the VCO one all the way on. Now let's go over to uh, VCO two, and we're gonna also set it to a triangle wave. And we're going to turn it down now to the first octave on the bottom. We're going to leave the pitch alone. We're going to set the shape at noon again, and we're going to turn the VCO2 all the way on in the mixer. Uh, we're going to leave the modulation section alone. We're not going to touch that, but we are going to turn the noise on to uh, about 10 o'clock, 10 or 11 o'clock there. Cool, so now let's adjust our filter settings. Uh, let's set the filter cutoff slightly past noon, maybe between 12 and one o'clock. Uh, we're gonna leave the resonance alone and uh, we can just set the um, envelope generator intensity at zero. And then we're gonna set the filter to a four pole fil filter. As much darker sound now. All right, cool. Let's go to the amp section now. We're going to set the attack uh, kind of about eight o'clock. Just, uh, just a little bit there. We're going to turn the decay all the way on, the sustain all the way on, and the release. We're also going to set it about eight o'clock. Uh, we're not going to mess with the envelope generator. We'll leave that be. Uh, the next thing we're going to do is the LFO section here. We're going to add a little bit of modulation. So let's set the wave to a triangle wave. We're gonna leave the uh, EG mod off. We're gonna set the rate a little bit between 11, 12 o'clock. Not quite 11, not quite 12, right in the middle there. Uh, the intensity of the LFO, we're gonna set it a little bit past nine o'clock there. And then the target, we wanna set it to target the shape. Cool, that's the sound for the most part. Uh, if we wanna go a little bit further, we can add a little bit of delay. So let's set the high pass at zero here. We're gonna set this to be uh, post filter. And then the feedback, set it at about 11 o'clock. And then the time, set it at about two o'clock there. Now to play the song, we're basically just playing a D minor chord and an E minor chord. And as Mark points out in his video, when Alex Turner plays it live, uh, he usually plays the whole chord and then takes his finger off the high note.
But if you want to be lazy with it, you can just go to chord mode here, go to chord mode, and then turn this knob here to minor. And you can just play it with one finger. And that's it. That's the organ sound from 505 by the Arctic Monkeys on the Korg Mini Log. Let me know in the comments what you think. What did I miss? What suggestions do you have for this patch? Also, let me know what other mini log patches you'd like me to try next. And as always, if you like this video, like this video. And if you dig what I'm doing on this channel, please subscribe. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day.